Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be providing a market analysis for Binance Coin and going over some very key levels of support and resistance to watch out for and potentially where I would start to bid on this. So if you're new to the channel and you want to show some support, please leave a like and subscribe. So the first thing I want to talk about is these moving averages here. This red one is the 20 day simple moving average and the green one is the 21 day exponential moving average. Together they form this band and as you can see we are holding this as resistance in the short term. So if I just go back and identify um, all these major resistance areas, we can see how we have been rejecting off of these moving averages pretty consistently here. And if I take a measured move in just a second here, you can see how we have not been above these moving averages in a very long time. So if we take a look here, um, we have not been above these moving averages for about 82 days. So we've been holding resistance along these moving averages and they have been declining. And once again, we are retesting this. Hopefully and ideally for BNB, we want to see a price action move above these moving averages and then starting to reclaim them and hold them as support. So just to give you an illustration of what that would look like, maybe we come back up um, a little bit higher, consolidate, and then start moving back up, targeting some of these higher levels. So we, in this case, we would flip this, this moving average from resistance into support. And most likely what it would look like, it would have a rounding bottom pattern and then start trending back up. So this is ideally what we wanna see for BNB moving forward in the next few weeks. And then if we do have this, if we have some sort of scenario where we do reclaim these moving averages and we start to move back up, I would look towards this range here from $334 all the way up to $339 as potential major resistance. So if we go back, we can see how in this mini blow off top in February of 2021, this high here was around $332. And then we can see how this also corresponded to the low in September of 2021. So we had this pivot area on this low, we turned around, made a new all time high. And we also saw how this was the range low in January and February of this year. So once we broke below it, we came back up and we retested it as resistance. So following this rejection, we came back down and formed some lower lows. So we have a lot of confluence around this range. And if we we're able to make our way back above this, I would consider this to be pretty major resistance. And I would most likely expect some sort of rejection in the event that we do make our way back up to that range. But it's a very key sign if we are if we are starting to reclaim this as well. So let's say in the next few weeks, we start to get back up here and then we get back, We maybe we reject it first, but ultimately we get back and start holding this as support and claiming it. If we have something like this, whether it be in a few weeks or a few months, when this does happen, that's going to be the sign for me that BNB is ready to start moving back up to this range high and all time high at around $669. So if we're able to see this mid range, um, reclaimed, then that's going to be a very bullish sign. And for me, that's that's kind of the sign I'm looking for to start getting really bullish on Binance Coin. But it, it's definitely a long ways away. Um, it doesn't matter if that happens in the next few weeks or even in a year or two. When that does happen, that's going to be a very bullish sign for me and something I'm going to be personally watching out for. And in general, um, I think Binance Coin is going to be a, a pretty good performer for the next bull market, considering how much reach they have as an exchange and, and the smart chain they have with a lot of active users. So overall, I think Binance Coin is a solid token and one of the tokens that I would expect to absolutely um, sort of maintain its, its reputation, maintain its kind of popu popularity for, for the next cycle. So a lot of altcoins actually die from cycle to cycle. Some of them never see highs again, but I don't think that's going to be the case with Binance Coin. I think it's a great altcoin. And overall, I'm pretty excited to see where this goes as far as um, the next cycle. So that's the end of my video. I hope you guys did enjoy. And as always, I will see you in the next one.